Hey folks, Quick Mind here, just making a quick update video on uh, what's going on and some of the things I've been doing. Uh, first off, uh, getting real close to finishing that computer. Uh, I have three parts and windows to get, and I'm planning on getting the processor Tuesday, or at least buying it. That'll leave me uh, RAM and a video card and then Windows to buy. So I'm pretty excited. Uh, let's see. I'm going to be recording a couple episodes here after uh, I upload this one. Um, that last episode of UFO Extra Trash Reels was kind of a bummer. <laughs> uh, I can't believe I took Jeremy out as far as I did. Uh, I was just, as much as I don't want to admit it, I was way overconfident with the equipment he had. Uh, my back of my head kept telling me, you know, don't do it, don't do it. And I did it anyway, thinking, ah, oh, it shouldn't be too hard to finish the mission. And if that armor did anything, I'd hate to see what that damage would have been without it. Because that was a lot of fire damage. So, hopefully this next episode is not going to be as bad. Um, let's see. Oh, and uh, with Baldur's Gate... Uh, I've been doing a lot of uh, exploring lately and uh, doing side missions, side quests, stuff like that. Uh, if you guys are watching that and you want me to get back on the main path, let me know. You know, uh, after all, I'm here to entertain you guys and have fun with you. And, you know, if you're not having fun watching me explore everything, you know, let me know. That way I can make it better for everybody. Um... I just saw this game yesterday. Uh, it's called, uh, and I, I think it's Swedish. It's called Rimmed Capsule. Rimmed Capsule. Uh, R Y M D K A P S E L. And uh, I had never heard of it before, uh, but I was watching. Um, a past broadcast of this guy on Twitch. And I was like, what kind of game is this? You know, what kind of name is that? So I checked it out and uh I I'm I'm I was hooked on it before I even bought it. It's only eight bucks on Steam and it was originally on uh, mobile platforms first. So like the Apple Store and uh, Google Play, stuff like that. Um but it came out on Steam in December I believe. And it's such a simple game, but it's so addicting, at least for me, because it has the elements in, in a strategy game that I love. Um, it is part Tetris, part, uh, part tower defense, part uh, like Age of Empires, Starcraft, stuff like that, where you build a base. And... Uh, you just play it until you die, pretty much. And it's, it's so cool. <laughs> um, I was playing that a bit yesterday, and uh, I finished my game this morning. I finally lost. Uh, the game gets quicker as time goes on, and I well, finally couldn't keep up. But, man, it's such a cool game. So I, I highly recommend that. Um, other than that, uh, I think that's about it. All I wanted to up update you guys on. Um... Oh, um, after I build my new computer, uh, I plan on doing uh, kind of like a, like a co-broadcast Let's Play of uh, Star Wars uh, Knights of the Old Republic 1. Uh, and that's going to be with a uh, Let's Player named Tobzi. Uh, I did make a playlist of um, a co-broadcast he and I are doing. Uh, for him, uh, he's doing XCOM Enemy Unknown or Enemy Within, and uh, and I gave him a challenge to do, which was uh, no snipers and uh, no augments. So I have a playlist of his videos on uh, on my account. So go check him out. Uh, he's doing pretty well. A uh, real great guy. Uh, he's from Norway, and uh, uh, I highly recommend watching his stuff as well. So. Uh, other than that, um, 
I did beat XCOM Enemy Within on normal and I uh, started a, uh, a classic difficulty game and once again I'm reminding or I'm reminded of uh, the change in difficulty between normal and classic because uh, I thought the uh, uh, the genetics and augments in uh, Enemy Within made the game way easier than it originally was. While well, I'm learning in Classic, it's going to be very difficult to even obtain those upgrades. So we're seeing how that's going. Uh, I'd like to do a Let's Play on that someday uh, once I get it down. And uh, of course, I'll be doing the Bureau XCOM Declassified as well. I uh, kind of want to wait till the computer's done being built for that as well, uh, because um, it does take some power to play it, and uh, uh, even when I wasn't recording it, which I haven't recorded it, but uh, I had the graphics down either from medium to low uh, just to play it smoothly. So I, I want something nicer for you guys before I record it. Um, and, I and I beat that game on the second and third highest difficulties as well. So, uh, definitely looking forward to that. That's a cool game. So, uh, at this point, yeah, I'm, I'm done talking now. So, um, yeah, so I'll get the recording here in a minute. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you have any questions or anything, or any um, recommendations, or anything you'd like to say, just let me know. So, catch you guys later.